My uh, thought uh, today is uh, getting a good workout. It's quite windy today. And I have it hooked up to uh, a portable uh, battery uh, pack. It's an 18 amp hour battery. And uh, I am not getting a lot of uh, charge in it. It's not like as if I plugged the uh, battery back pack into AC and then in, uh, in a few hours it would go from say 12.6 to to 13.5 uh, volts. Uh, when I plug it in this morning it was 12.6. Now it's about 12.65, uh, 12.64. Uh, so it's giving it a charge not a whole lot. So the question I have is uh, what is the best way to measure uh, the output of the windmill? I know you can use a multimeter uh, in line uh, and measure the amps uh, that way. Uh, I have tried that. Uh, what I got is uh, very low output I expected that because this is, this is a low output uh, alternator. I get between 20 milliamps to 30 milliamps. Uh, but this uh, alternator is capable of putting out more than 30 volts. And since I have a 12 volt battery, uh, I suspect a lot of the power is lost in the alternator. Uh, burned up as heat because the alternator is not, not really matched to the battery. If I have, say, a 24 volt battery, it would uh, be more efficient that way. I've also seen other people measuring the output uh, with resistors, uh, 1 watt, 2 watt, 3 watt resistors. And I've also seen you know, the easiest way is to use, uh, say, like a 12 volt light bulb. Uh, and see how well it would light it up. You could use a 12 volt, 10 watt, or 5 watt light bulb. Uh, so I'm a little confused as to what is a good way to uh, to measure the output. Uh, this alternator can light up a string of LEDs brightly, at least eight of them or ten of them, and it can go up. So I would I would think uh, it would go it can uh, generate up to 30 more than 30 volts uh, when I hand spin it, it it will definitely go up to 30 volts without a low it could go up to 40 volts in fact uh, right now I have it hooked up to a battery so uh, it's under load and I understand that uh, it will not spin as fast when it is under load uh, even though you have a good wind it has it was spinning pretty uh, quickly before uh, when you have a good gust. So if I go by the uh, uh, way of measuring amps with a multimeter in line, I'm getting like 30 milliamps and uh, the voltage would remain at uh, between 12 to or 12.5 to 13 volts. So if you time volts by milliamps, you're getting very, very, a very tiny amount of uh, wattage. Uh, so I am a little, again, like I said, a little confused. Uh, how can something that can light up 10 OEDs uh, be less than, much less than one watt? in actual output when charging a battery. So maybe someone can uh, give me some guidance as to what is a good way to measure the output of, uh, of a windmill. Uh, if I were to charge a smaller battery, the voltage would go up quickly. If I were to charge like a 4 amp hour battery, uh, it would go up fairly quickly. It would go from 12.6 to 12.7, 12.8 uh, fairly quickly. 
but since this is uh, 18 mm hour, so the voltage seems to be going up slowly. Actually, when it is turning slowly like this, uh, it's not really generating any power at all. Uh, it has to turn pretty quickly. This is maybe like 20 RPM. It has to go to 80 or 100 RPM to really uh, give out some power. So tonight is a good night to test the output because uh, I have wind and I have rain. Okay, thanks for watching.